This is sprawl mat conditioning. This is the sprawl technique. This is the sprawl technique, the sport specific technique that will be done within these particular drills on the throw mat or landing mat. So we can see here the athlete will have both his hands up at chest level, his feet a little bit more in shoulder width, his head up, and he's going to hit or knock out the mat from side to side, left hip to right hip. Though you can do both hips at one time. You want to posture up as high as you can so it makes it a full range of motion technique which makes it a little bit more enduring on your body. This is great for muscular and cardiovascular endurance and overall workout for the athlete or the fighter. As you can see here, in between each sprawl, you're going to chop your feet no more than four times. The goal is to try to get as many sprawls as you can in a particular round or a set within the round. So he's going to hit the sprawl left or right side or left or right hip, come back up, chop his feet real quick, and then hit it again. Again, posturing up as high as you can. Hands are at your chest level, feet a little bit more shoulder width, head remains up. And you're trying to knock these sprawls out as fast as you can on the throw mat or the landing mat. Hello everyone, Bruce Lombard here, owner of Lombard MMA and creator of Lombard MMA Fit. I'm hopeful this instructional video is helpful in your learning and your future application of the technique. Please use the comment section below if you have any questions regarding this technique or about your martial arts training and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Check out LombardMMA.com for hundreds of more instructional videos, more home fitness workouts, nutritional tips, motivational quotes, training tips, and application strategies. Please subscribe to the Lombard MMA YouTube channel where you can get the most recent updates and new videos as they are posted. Thank you for training with Lombard MMA. Hope to see you back again soon.